Today's game is coming to you live from Luniapolis, Craziana. We're at Mucus Asylum Stadium, and the inmates are taking their medication along with their seats, sharpening their knives, and hopefully not listening to the voices in their heads. Pain, suffering, humiliation, and possibly a conga line. This game's gonna have it all. The Purple Mutant Eaters go up against the Insane Cults. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> It's game day here on the MFL Network, and we are just about to get underway. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. Any thoughts on today's game? Uh, uh, mm. and, uh, no, not really. Kind of flatlining right now in the thoughts department. Uh, hey, can you help me get this pencil out of my ear? It's stuck worse than it was the last time. Hey, you idiot. And it's first and ten. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. First and ten. And these guys are marching down the field unopposed. And it's first and ten. here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. <laughs> Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Bloody and disgusting. Hey, anyone in the boat for a steak kebab? Make mine rare. And it's first and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well placed cleat. Second down and six. First and ten. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. First and ten. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And that'll be second down and four. Roid rage. Because if you can't answer your question with violence, ask enough. And into the end zone for a touchdown. 
Once he got his hands on that pass, he was on to the races. Yeah, man, I was hanging on the pedal now. They all have. <laughs> Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. That's a gain of seven yards on the catch. Nicely done. Second and three. And that's a nice run for a first down. First and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. And it's first and ten. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Second down and seven. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. sanctioned NFL rule. They're back up here on first. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down in a mile. And that's a sack. Speaking of sacks, has anybody seen my powder? I'm itching like crazy over here. <laughs> Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. forever he dropped it if he does that again they'll drop him well they couldn't pick up a first down so now they have to punt nice punt should move them back night nice cap ouch what is this Andy's wrestling It's first and ten. Defense gives up five yards on that pass play. And so at the end of one, we're all tied up. We'll be right back. Second down and five. Stop 
Briggs. Yeah, tell him me. Nice run. No, I mean, he's a real stud. He works at the Mutant Stud Farm weekends and summers. scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. A pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. Look at him go! You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And he runs it in for the touchdown. You know, letting these dogs into the league is a slippery slope, Grim. First them, then vampires, then mermaids. <laughs> then before you know it, we're letting in cat girls. You know, things really start to get weird at that point. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Holy crap! He mistimed the spikes and ends up dead. Life is full of misery, man. Loneliness, suffering. just ended up in the meat wagon. They'll need to find another player on their bench who can kick field goals. Good luck with that. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And it's first and ten. And that's some good old-fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. Simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. And this guy is supercharged with electricity. Fumble! You've got to protect the ball better than that. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Just a great run for a touchdown. Okay. Oh, 
it shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. <laughs> and that's the end of his day. And it's first and ten. Warp speed on the stage. What are you trying to impress you today? His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. He's at the ten. I've seen this guy run through a brick wall. He loves pain. First down and one. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown. Touchdown. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. First and ten. It looks like I'm surprised no one uses the oh, and he fumbles the ball on that hit. He sick when he should have zagged and ends up a shish kebab. He broke free and has open field in front of him. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Now there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Disgusting. Hey, anyone in the mood for a steak kebab? Make mine rare. And it's first and ten. The defense calls. Ain't nothing worse than wasting a good explosive. First down and forever. Feel like a monkey trying to... The offense just burned the defense pretty hard on that one. That is still edible, though. Just got to... And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Frankenfood you'll have fun trying to identify.
The teams line up for the kickoff to start the second half. These guys will have to play a lot harder to make it a game. Well, either that or kill and cheat more. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. And it's first and ten. his mom decided to move back in with us. Second down and two. And this guy looks like Thor on the road. There's no reason to drop the ball if you're still alive. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a frog in my head. It was a chick wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. You need to get great disposable income. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I pictured that, uh, that, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. <laughs> When I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and 10. Second down and more than the QB would like. And that is called for a first down. First down and three. Or they're gonna lose. Not like they need any help with that, though, Trent. These guys are doing 
fine by themselves. And this is a first and long. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. First down in a mile. Oh, great pass on that play. They caught the defense napping. Second down and long. with me well you mistaken man you get up in my grill i'm gonna ruin your world i'm gonna wreck it and they line up for the extra point straight through the uprights the teams are lined up for the kickoff he sits up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And it's first and ten. in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. hit that was and that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size because he just walked all over him third down and ten and he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down this guy has a nice set of hands grim it's the third set of hands he's had so long today Looks like it's a good fit. And that player hits it. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown. And that's quite a creative and intuitive dance he's doing. Hey, Grim, what do you call a wolf who is intuitive? No, 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 what? And a werewolf. <laughs> oh, man, I just cracked myself up. And here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. <laughs> when 
When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. You've got to avoid those spikes or you'll be a mutant pincushion. I was a chubby kid, Grim. My parents sent me to fat camp. My big brother told me as soon as you get there, stab the first kid you see and no one will mess with you. So I get off the bus at the camp, some kid runs up to me and stabs me. And it's first and ten. Starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Second down and two. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third and two. Oh, and he just turned ginormous. Look out. He is fighting for every... And he'll pick up the first down with a nice piece of running there. And it's first and ten. Looks like a pass. And it's bouncing right back to the QB. Oh, it's the sticky ball dirty trick. Ah, oh, pass the popcorn, Grim. Zoom in on his face, then his crotch. I want to see if he cries or pisses himself first. Second down in a lot. Man, how did he screw that up? No one died. Bombs don't kill mutants, Grim. Mutants kill mutants. Third down and long. for a second there. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he put all of his foot into that one. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Put oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have to meet at the dice, Grim. First and ten. The Roy Rage dirty trick transforms a player into a rampaging lunatic. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. And that is called for a first down. And it's first and ten. Man, he's running like a bull on steroids. That'll be a first down. And it's first and ten. Cornerback is down. Zoom in on his face. I want to see if the little bastard's crying. <laughs> Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. harder than that and that is unfortunate <laughs> defense was there but he still picked up a yard somehow second down and five
Third down, and the punter is warming up. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. here or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. trying to get the ball back for another shot. Second down and two. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And that's two timeouts gone for the defense. But they've really got to get the ball back to their offense. But the offense is like 30 balls over there on the sideline just waiting for them. Why don't they just use them? the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum oh. and killing. The defense just used their last time out and there's still plenty of game left to play. Well, congratulations. You just played yourself. Memes won't make you cool, Bricks, no matter what your mom says. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it, too. Second down and ten. Perfect pass and a score! Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing.
When in a hurry up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. The insane Colts are defeated today. And let's go down to the field and hear the MVP. He's a real role model for the kids, Bricks. That is, if you want your kids to be a roid raging narcissist with uncontrollable verbal diarrhea. Oh, that personality disorder has a name. It's called autotropism. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it. So